right so as i told you i will send the puzzle you can uh, paste on the now you have reserved the page you can paste on the page and uh, you can uh, complete the puzzles or you can draw the puzzles and complete it one of that you can do it uh, for the homework right so i will check the books uh, once the school starts i collect the books and i check them right now let's uh, going to do the lesson number 2 landscape of sri lanka right so lesson number 1 is i think complete and lesson number 2 once this lesson number 2 is complete i will give you the uh, small test right i will give you small test about the saying like uh, first term test something like right i will give you a small test right okay so in this lesson uh there are outcomes of this lesson what do you mean by outcomes that means once this lesson is studied we must know all of these points so what is relief drainage climate and natural vegetation and the components of the physical landscapes uh all those facilities i mean the physical backgrounds the objective of the this chapter is that right so what we are going to learn is all those facts in the in sri lanka right so this is about the, as we mentioned in the heading landscape of sri lanka so we are now going to study about the sri lanka but in first lesson what we did uh, study we studied about america or is it about uh, india or what asian Asian region. Asian, about Asian region. Asian, right? Yeah. So first lesson we studied about Asian, Asian region, and the specialty of the Asian region, region, right? And the location of Asian region we studied. But in the second lesson. And the industries. Yes, about the Asian. But in the second lesson we are going to study about Sri Lanka, right? It's all about Sri Lanka, right? So now we are when we are talking about. uh sri lanka first thing is the physical landscape of sri lanka we are going to learn physical landscape so shall we write down this one first write first of all uh, heading right scape of uh, landscape of sri lanka this is the heading lesson number 2 heading you have to write down like this then only you have to write the you have to write down this one right Tarun, yes, sir. Uh, Tarun, can you give the the screenshot of the first people who have come here? Okay, sir. And uh, make it mark who have who signed the attendance. I I. 
why do I ask the, the uh, to take attendance? So every time when we are having online uh, geography class, so you have to get the people who have done the attendance, right? So they are okay. in the beginning and in the end, right? Just take two uh, screenshots in the beginning and in the end. Patangarana samara ya guru dinle ande ano ya ya kau juga bala kan tu lana pilih tu bala. Inda patangani me di, awasangi ni me dekka bela man. Pilih skena raga na pasca nama ni kita mat karna raga nanti kali ella dini dara dah, right? So don't send it. Just keep it you. Yes. Yes, samara. Memang dana samara kacau deh. Ia ada karan tu jangan sehebo dia tu tinggal itu kita tapi lupa uten ni nol. Karan tu juga sama. Ekorita phone ni kan log in dek buat. Phone tu ni kita hamu tu mager phone tu, no hamu tu mager data tu, no. This is the alternation that they can log in using the phone. Okay, finish. Finish, sir. Finish, sir. Finish, sir. Finish, sir. Right. Uh, so, what do you mean by relief? There are main three major zones in Sri Lanka as following, right? So, what do you mean by relief? Yes. Relief means there are some, uh, like uh, there are some uh, activities which are being created due to the the long term of the uh, long term of the geo activities, right? So this is the result of geo activities of the long term. Like uh, uh, we have a uh, lot of activities already, lot of relief features here. What are those relief features? Central mountains. Yeah. So according to that, we have divided into two part, three parts. What are those three parts? Coastal plain. Coastal plain. Central mountains. Central mountains. Right. So out of that, we have to study about the coastal plain. So shall we move to that coastal plain? What is about it? Uh, so, uh, shall we do like this? Uh, can you write down the top uh, heading like coastal pain? Right. Only coastal plain, sir, not other, sir. Just only coastal plain. Tenuja. Uh, Tenuja, are you there? Right. So, 
Shall we read about the costal pain here? Anusara, can you read this costal pain? Yes, sir. The region from sea level up to the 30 meter quantal line along the coast belongs to the coastal plain. In the south, in certain places, the coastal plain is about 3 kilometers narrow, and in the north, it is north, it is about 32 kilometers wide. The coastal plain consists of various relief features. The lower areas of river valley and the river mouth regions belong to this. The coastal plain has several special features such as flat land, points, lagoons, sand dunes, as well as the features like braided rivers, marshy lands, and deltas. Right. So, what do you mean that? What do you understand about Akane? Akane, what do you understand about this paragraph? The region from here up to 30 meters from line along the coastal belongs to the coastal plain. Right. So, what do you mean by coastal plain, Sadhuru? Sandhuru, what do you mean by coastal pain? Coastal pain about 30 kilometers narrow. Right. Features. Uh, right, okay. I want to the other Sandhuru also, Satsara. Sandhuru Satsara, you don't know what is about the coastal pain? No idea. Uh, Sandula. Coastal plain is uh, from sea level up to the 30 meters, and there are features like uh, flat lands, points, lagoons, sand downs. Yes. Yes, coastal plain means the area where you and we are live, right? So that means from the sea to uh, kilometers, sorry, meters, 30 kilometers up to up country, right? If we are making a counter line on that uh, 30 meters of the area, so all the area of that uh, beach side, coastal area is called coastal plain, right? So due to uh, many natural uh, co activities, so there are many features in the coastal area, right? Because of the uh, many activities of the natural co activities, there can be many features in the coastal area. So that part we were talking about uh, lagoons, rivers, and uh, points. No, there are many of them, right? Okay, shall we write down this on coastal area then? Okay. So the whole paragraph. Sorry? Coastal area is a coastal area is a, is concerned. Coastal area is concerned. Coastal area is concerned. Coastal area is concerned. From the sea level, from the sea level, from the sea level, up to 30 meters, up to 30 meters, from the sea level, from the sea level, up to 30 meters, up to 30 meters. Can you repeat the sentence, please? Pinsara, uh, can you repeat it again? Coastal area concerned from the sea level up to 30 meters. Thank you, sir. Up to 30 meters. Due to many 
due to many natural activities due to many natural activities due to many natural activities of this region of this uh, of this coastal area due to many natural activities of this coastal area there can be there can be many there can be many relief features relief features that can be seen as following these features that can be seen as following that can be as following seen as following so where you have to write down and down uh, marsh marshes so one feature is relief feature is marshes the marshlands are very important for the human beings right for their lives it's very important marshlands so can you tell me a name of a marshland where around here bundal kalbike kalbike ha muthurajavela somavati yeah muthurajavela somavati kalbike all those are uh, uh, very uh, famous marshlands in the in the in the island and especially the mutrajagal is the big area where we can see the marshlands right so this lands are very important why it is very important who can tell me why it is very important there are many reasons first thing is all the because it can, uh, controlling floods yeah that's why right. all the raining of this uh, area and uh, all these are going and stay in the marshlands therefore the flooding is not available i mean uh, it stop the flooding of the area so no? and that the first thing that there other one is because of this marshland there are many creatures are there right living creatures uh, from which we are going to get lot of uh, thing like uh, oxygens and uh, sometimes some uh, fish there right so they are available and some uh, biodiversity biodiversity yes. and some trees are available which is very important for the human beings uh, to the breathing systems and all so it is very important right and uh, those days uh, the government was Prohibiting to enter even to send anyone into that land area. Such so much of a very important land is the marshy lands. But nowadays they are not concerning. They are going to unauthorized building in their that areas, and there are a lot of uh, many things are going on going on. Anyhow, so this is a one feature that we can see in coastal area. One feature we can see in the coastal. area right so write down this much land uh these these are formed these are formed these are formed when the sediments brought by rivers when the sediments when the sediments brought by rivers
सेडिमेंट्स के लग यानी राइट so so much dams are formed from the uh, sediments brought by the rivers and deposit that area right that is called marsh dams right okay okay sir right uh, this land helps to this land helps to helps to stop helps to stop helps to stop flooding 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 in your outro flooding flooding ganga tura the overflow of rivers and the overflow of rivers and rainwater the overflow of rivers and rainwater ah uh, rainwater ah uh, keep in them ah uh, keep in them therefore 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 many living creatures many living creatures many living creatures and some plants and trees and some plants and trees and some plants are trees are available are available in this marshy land in this marshy land in this marshy land which are very help which are very helpful for human lives which are very helpful for human life which are very helpful for human life the example of marsh dams are the example of marsh dams are the katakal yaganda mutrajavela kundala ara pote thiyena e nandikal yaganda kundala alemitiyawa somavati oy ma nandika thiyena yaganda kerala kale Right. Uh, finish. Yes, sir. 